Uh, hey, what's up guys? Comfy Neat here. Um, so I've got a confession I want to make and that is that I am a fucking man-child. Okay, it's not really confession if everybody knows, but I feel like, I don't know, maybe it's not that obvious that I'm a man-child, but I pretty much am, if I think about it pretty clearly. And uh, this is for several reasons. Um, I guess one is the fact that I really, um, down to the root of it, um, don't want any responsibilities. And I feel like when most people grow up from like kids to adults, like, first of all, I don't really know whether being a man child is a bad thing because maybe it's it refers to people who just um don't want to follow the the rigid expectations and i guess rules of society and you know the pressures that are placed upon them to conform and i guess like give up their dreams and the things they actually like to um i don't know I guess partake in these so-called responsibilities that are supposed to make your life so much better, but do they actually? But um, that's besides the point. Um, yeah, uh, in terms of me being a man-child, I, yeah, I really seem to be the type of person that doesn't want any responsibilities, doesn't want any commitment, and just wants to basically do whatever he wants why am I talking about myself in the third person? What? Well, well, I basically want to do um, whatever I want, whenever I want, at my whim, basically, whenever I feel like it, and just, you know, relax and, you know, mostly do things that I enjoy doing, even though sometimes I don't feel any joy doing them when I'm, like, slightly depressed. But for the most part, I feel... A lot of pleasure in doing things like you know the usual suspects that I've mentioned before like video games for example and um, yeah there's that and it's not just that but also I guess it's my interests are very childlike like for example I know at my age right let's say I'm basically okay fuck I don't know if you'd be telling my age but I'm basically in my mid twenties and you know, I feel like people my age, they're, they're getting into things like cars and I don't know, fucking electronics because I guess they can afford it working a job being wage slave. And um, I guess I like that stuff too, but not to that extent. Like as far as electronics goes, the only thing I might be interested in are like anything related to gaming. So, um, you know, anything like console related, switch related and stuff like that. And I'm not really into things like, I don't know, like skydiving or fucking, what do you, what do guys my age even do? Like skydiving? Um, I guess a lot of fitness stuff, like I like it a little bit, but I'm not like hardcore into it, hardcore into it and like change my diet maybe it's because i'm lazy i don't know but that's like another ad adult mature thing to do um and there's um what else sports um playing and i guess watching i mean i do like basketball i do like the nba but i'm not like it's not my life you know like it is for some people most of my time is just spent gaming, you watching YouTube videos about games or other like immature stuff and anime, I guess. That's, I guess, like a teenager thing that I should have gotten over, but well, according to society, I think it's fine. Like I think anime has a lot of depth that is missing from a lot of mainstream TV. Like, can't even think of any shows. I don't know, Orange is the New Black, like, is that, that's a famous show, right? Like, or, well, I guess Game of Thrones is pretty good, but, um, 
until the last season, but I'm rambling. Um, I'm also man child because my sense of humor seems to be very immature and like, I don't know, like slapstick in a way, but I find like writing really obnoxious and gross shit, like really hilarious on the internet. Like, um, I don't know, like, uh, there's this subreddit called copy, copy pass, copy pasta. How the fuck you pronounce that? Um, and I find that shit incredibly hilarious. Just like the most obnoxious, like degenerate shit. Like for me, I find something like the more degenerate it is or the more obnoxious or offensive something is, the more I find it funny. And I don't know. I feel like that a lot of mature people might find that shit edgy or, you know, yeah, I guess edgy is the right word or like teenager humor, but I find that shit hilarious. Like I listen to sarcasm and like stand up comedy and I get the jokes, but I don't find them funny. I just find them so like mainstream and, and bland and Except for maybe a few of them, like, I don't know. I found Bill Burr pretty funny and some other guy, I forget his name, but he's also like, uh, yeah, I guess he's pretty politically incorrect. I guess I find the Eric Andre show pretty funny because that pretty much sums up my sense of humor, which is, I guess, nihilistic and obnoxious and just, I don't know, postmodern, even though I'm not exactly a postmodernist, but I find that sort of like no, no rules sort of just fucking say the most obnoxious shit and, you know, dump like buckets of cum on people. Like I find that shit hilarious. <laughs> okay. Sorry about that. Um, how else am I a man child? Um, I guess not wanting to be part of the workforce would, I guess, technically make me a man child or not really not be part of the workforce like i want to be a part of society but you know more on my own terms if that makes any sense and um so what i mean by that is like i do have a passion for music which i keep mentioning but i feel like not many of you have heard my music i will be sharing a soundcloud soon and um yeah i want to make a career out of that but i don't actually spend the time necessary like working on music but i just mostly waste time on trivial stuff which um i guess is another sign of me being a man child because i don't have that ability to delay gratification and put up like i guess distractions for doing something that's important to me because i guess like i mentioned in my procrastination video when I consider something a responsibility, not just a job, but like a responsibility, I just stop doing it because maybe that's just like the inner child in me being immature and not actually doing anything useful. And, but yeah, also just the idea that I want to make it in the world, following my passions, my dreams, isn't that a very childish thing to do? So you, know, so you know what, maybe society is shit. Maybe I should just be a man child, but I don't really know. Maybe I'm deluding myself. Maybe society's right. Maybe I'm using this, I, this, dream, this idea of chasing my dreams as an excuse to just lounge around all day and not do shit. But yeah, that's just, I don't know. Because I feel like I'm supposed to, you know, have fun in college and, you know, whatever, chase my dreams while I'm still young and then join the workforce and become some salary man like in Japan and um, just work that nine to five, that nine to five grind, you know, hustle, work hard, nine to five grind, blah, 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 do all that shit. And you know, make, make that money and then spend it on, you know, spend it at the club buying girls who aren't really interested in you drinks and random shit that I'm probably never going to use. Cause I guess that's a mature thing to do. 
and I'm, I'm not criticizing society. Like maybe that's what it takes to run a functioning society with, you know, fucking hundreds of thousands, millions of people. Maybe there need to be cogs in the machine and maybe that's just what I'm meant to be, but I don't want to be that. So maybe I'm the immature one or maybe society's just shit. I have no idea. But yeah, um, I guess by that definition, I would be a man child because I don't really know if I'm right or not. Because clearly things aren't working out for me. I'm a neat. I don't have a social life pretty much. Don't have any real life friends. I, you know, I've never had a girlfriend. <laughs> um, fuck. What else? Yeah. Yeah, this is getting pretty depressing. Um, how else am I a man child? I, yeah, just because of the lack of responsibility and stuff, I don't engage in a lot of these adult rituals like grooming and taking care of myself, you know, fucking wearing old spice. Cause I don't know. I sometimes use the, the ax, uh, stick deodorant because I feel like it smells better but you know maybe that's because I'm an immature teenager even my my sense of fashion my taste and clothes if you look at my wardrobe it's pretty juvenile it's pretty like something like a teenager would wear mostly hoodies I don't have any like dress shoes like I don't know brogues or whatever the fuck you call like all these other types of like silhouettes and stuff like that yeah, it's like stuff a teen would wear, and I'm also a man child in the sense that I don't know, maybe my appearances are part of that too. Like, I just look like a child, like, my hair is not done in an adult way, it's not slicked back, I still have bangs, or I, um, my face is very young looking because for some reason I just have a really chubby face, chubby cheeks and doesn't allow me to look mature so I kind of look like this weird like hybrid like toddler slash adult and also you know it comes across in the way people treat me um my parents will say shit to me like oh you're eat more you're a growing boy like what i'm a growing boy i'm like in my mid-20s early mid-20s i'm not that old well maybe i'm just coping i don't know yeah my early mid-20s and yeah um i was ordered food at this restaurant and then some waiter who probably was my age you know, maybe it's because he's white, so he ages a little faster than me because I'm I'm Asian. I have that neoteny going for me, but he's like, he was like, hey, buddy, here's your burger. Like, talking to me as if I'm, like, some teenager because I guess I look like a teenager, but it's not just that. It's the fact that it's a vibe that I give off because I give off, like, immature teenager vibes and I dress like one, so that there's that too. So, yeah, um... I'm basically a fucking man child and um I mean I'm guilty as charged. I don't know what else to say. Like look at me right now. I'm just fucking <laughs> I don't know. The way my posture is, I I don't have any conviction like a like a real adult would, a real I don't know, a real man would, because I'm a guy, I guess. And um yeah. I fucking don't know. I my sleep schedule is that of like a teenager. Like my sleep schedule is that of a teenager if he just went off the rails and like stopped giving a shit about anything and just sleep at any any odd hour of the day, which is what I'm basically doing right now. And yeah. I'm sleeping three to four hours, like every eight hours, so it's so fucking weird. Like who even does that? I know like a normal functioning adult wouldn't do that. They would have a nine to five job or if not, they would be working on their own business consistently, sleeping at healthy hours. If that even is real, 
but that's not me. I'm a man-child.